Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa with the Stock Swoosh and reviewing AKRX. This was a loss today. Didn't work, just didn't work at all. Gave it two shots, just couldn't pull it together here. Falling now, but no reason to short this in the afternoon. Knew it would find its footing somewhere and drop. Um, but it looks like this probably will close green today. This is a decent watch for tomorrow to short, although, again, I like to do new gaps. It was a gap today on news. It was fine. It was good. It just couldn't get going. Here's the drop, and actually, it did have, a, 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 it did have actually a drop. I shouldn't say it didn't have any drop at all. I mean, if you look at the high here from where it opened and then the low down in here, it dropped to 1240. So 1240 was the low. So it did have about a 16 cent move uh, for this area here. And, you know, so I would never have gone long this in a million years. It was a horrible thing to go long, but it didn't work today right as a short. And again, I wouldn't even be in this this afternoon, although it could drop down at least to 13. Um, it's a watch for tomorrow to short. So this was a loser today. Sometimes you have losses, that's why we use stops. You put the stop in, if it stops you out, you take the loss. And you gotta have the same sizing in pretty much every trade you take so that your losses are condensed. When you do have to take a loss, then it's condensed. Then you can have one great trade or even two losses in one great trade and still make money. So it is about the focus, that's what I do. I usually look at one or two ticker symbols each day. This was a loser today, but the luckily the AA was a huge trade. And so it all worked out in the end. Have a great day, everyone. Email me if you're interested to learn more information on my gap strategy at melissa at thestockswish.com.